Boys and girls, cats, girls, what is going on? My name is Salty, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Sword and Shield Surprise Lock. Sorry, Hardcore Surprise Lock, Cage Lock. I'm here with Rival Roki. Introduce yourself. Hey, yo, what is going on, guys? Rival Roki here, back with Slightly Salty for some more Pokemon Sword and Shield action. Yeah, you guys have been loving this series. By the way, I'm moving. I don't know if you are, if you're just waiting for me to say something. Oh, um, no, dude, I'm going to grab my encounter here. Yeah. By the way, guys, you guys have been showing some amazing support in the comment section on the likes, the views. I mean, other people are even tweeting about our series. We absolutely love to see it. I'm so glad that you guys are enjoying this series. It means the world. Um, and also, if you guys are wondering what we're doing right now, well, we get two uh, wild area encounters per gym. So we're going to grab our encounters and then we are going to surprise trade them away. Yes, sir, and I just caught myself a little Temple, and I'm about to surprise temple. trade this bad boy. Yeah, I love Temple. It's just such a cute design. Oh, Temple's a beauty. I am currently catching a Stuffle. Ooh, Stuffle's another one I really liked a lot. Like, another just, like, cutie patootie mon that just evolved. Like, Beware is just hilariously comical to me. Yeah, it is. Dude, be uh, dude Beware is, like, one of the best things about the anime. Oh, yeah, I still need to watch that. I actually had a thought, like, a while back. I was like, I want to catch up, but, like, how far did I watch? I think I, like, fell off around Gen 4, as far okay. as the anime goes. So... I'm actually uh... not a big fan of the Alola anime. Um, Sword and Shield uh, Journeys... Well, it, it's not even Sword and Shield, it's just Journeys. Journeys I wasn't a big fan of, but Master <laughs> Journeys I love. Yeah, I heard it's really good, so it has me wanting to, like, go back and catch up and, like, watch all of them. Like, I know they're all kind of standalone, but there's still, like, certain things and, like, characters or, like, Pokemon and stuff that, you know, like, some story aspects that I think would be really cool to be able to check out. Yeah, for sure, for sure. So, maybe I'll do it one day, but there's just, like, there's so many good animes on my list right now that it's, like, do I really want to go and watch, like, Pokemon all over again? Yeah, exactly. See, I'm not big on anime, so, um, yeah. It's one of the things that Pancake Wizard gets on me. A Pancake and Wes both get on me about anime and not watching it, and I'm like, I'm just not a big anime person. Dude, now I can get on you about it too, dude, because there are some fire animes out there that I think that, like, so I wasn't really much of an anima eh, anime guy either. It wasn't until I was, like, in high school that, like, my friend showed me Gurren Lagann. And, like, I don't know if you've ever seen it or, like, people in the comments just, like, let, let him know down there that he needs to watch it. Because, like, it's such a hype anime, but it is just so freaking good. And, like, the end, it gets really outrageous, but it is just such a great anime that, like, it really got me into watching other ones. Like, I went back and watched all of, like, Dragon Ball and, like, all of, like, Z, um, Super, like, all of that. Um... What else? Yu Yu Hakusho, see, now, that's another, like, really good one. See, Dragon Ball is one that I kind of want to watch again because I used to watch it as a kid. Uh, me, my dad, and my brother used to love watching it. My brother recently got into watching it, um, and he was, like, talking to me about it, how it's, like, super hype now. And I'm like, hmm, do I get back into Dragon Ball? Oh, yeah, dude, absolutely. Like, Dragon Ball itself is really, like, just funny to watch. It, it's... It's hilarious, but it's also got a perfect mix of, like, comedy and action. Um, and then, like, Dragon Ball Z, it gets, like, a little more action-y, but still comical. It's still, like, funny to watch, but it's just, like, the action scenes and the fights and stuff are really good. Um, and then, like, GT I watched. GT was made by, like, somebody... Oh, I have to re-surprise trade. So I got a... Um, oh, I never called? connected to the internet. I caught two Bergmite? stuffles. <laughs> I got a I got my and it's level 39, so I have to surprise trade. I thought for sure I could keep it. That wouldn't have been yeah. horrible. Because, guys, our new level cap is actually level 27. <laughs> is it 27? I'm pretty sure. I thought it was 24. Oh, sorry. It's 24. 27 is the next gym. The third yes. gym. Yeah, the next, like, first three gyms are pretty much, like, all but back to back. Yeah, it is. It's literally we go through this route. We go through a route where we get the bike, actually. We're about to go get the bike. Yeah. But yeah, um Super Dragon Ball Super is literally like creative genius. Like that you absolutely need to watch. Oh, oh, oh yes. What'd you get? <clears throat> I'm probably overhyping this thing, but it's just like so so by this point in like in time like 
breaking fourth wall, like I, I've already gone on. I, I started a TikTok series, my very first TikTok series, thanks to Slightly Salty and Pancake for giving me the inspiration on that. But I started a Fire Red 898 series. Ooh, it's level one. That's nice. So we do get to keep it. Um, I don't know if that's really going to help us too much, but that's still good. So what, do you have this um, one in that? So basically, yeah, like I had, I had everybody vote like on my starter and Karko is like by a landslide winning. I still have to record episode two, but Karko is going to be my starter and I just got a level one Roly Coley. Not bad. Not bad. So yeah, not bad. Like I, I was saying a couple episodes back. Oh, oops. 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 Nope. Quit, quit, quit. Did Sorry, you I almost just want to trade your carcoal? No, I almost went into a den. Um, oh, well. But yeah, so I I said a couple episodes back that I really like Roly Coley and I really want one. And so like even though I have a reboot, like it like depending on its na uh bleh, ability, it's actually a really solid mod to have on my team. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> Cause like definitely. steam engine's really good. Especially, uh, especially if you could win and get the held item for the berry that resists water type moves. Oh yeah, absolutely. But all I have to do is win a cage match first, right? Yep. Speaking of, if you guys didn't watch the last episode, go back and check that out. Now, what are you doing here for starters? But go back and check that out because we had our very first cage match in that. It was pretty exciting. I thought it was a really close one, honestly. A lot closer than... I expected it to be, Same. but but yeah. Spoiler alerts! I most definitely lost. He did lose, um. but it was a good battle. Um, and yeah, I'm also currently getting uh the Toxel egg. Oh, sorry, it's not even an egg; it's just a Toxel. Yeah, it's just a straight Toxel. Also, dude, this egg. Electric will not stay in the ball. I've thrown three Pokeballs now. I'm throwing a Great Ball. I just don't have time for this. Come on, stay in the ball. All right. Oh, she cool. also gives us EXPS. Uh, excess um, e exp candy. Ooh, my yeah. first surprise trade is done. Okay, what you got? What you got? I don't know. Let's see what it is. I'm trading away a stuffle. I caught <clears throat> two stuffles in the wild area, and now I just got a toxel. See, I wanted something different, but I should have just gone for that temple because, like, that electric was way too difficult to catch. Did you catch the electric or no? Oh yeah, I caught him, dude. I had to throw blue balls at his face, but I caught him. Okay, so, um, so, so, if this is level one. <sighs> Salty, what did you get now? I got a level one German Gibble. This guy, who does he think he is? It only has Sand Tomb right now, but this is definitely coming on the team for Toodle. Oh, look at that. It's only got sand too, but it's still a gibble. Like, that thing is still going to be a full butt Garchomp later on. I'm going to wait to see what all my counters are before using some XP candies to get it trained up a little. Well, I know who I'm going for if I win a cage match. My gibble? Oh, heck yeah. Late game, that yeah. would be massive. Oh, absolutely. Like, I'm not even thinking about the here and now. Like... Lapras would be great to take out for like early game and stuff, especially. My Nido King. But that Garchomp is going to be. Yeah, Nido King as well. Both of those, especially because you have TMs on it, like both of those should be taken out. But I think beyond right. that, like, yeah. Surprise trade number two confirmed. I'm trading it away. I'm getting an Aeron. I'm pretty sure this is going to be level one. Aeron's not bad. I do like me some Aeron and some Laron and some Agron. Um, oh, yeah. would it join Absolutely. my team right now? Mm. Nope, never mind. The Aeron is level 63. Oh, wow. Where the heck did he get that thing? Uh, probably one of the DLC locations. You've got to be flip flop and kidding me right now. What'd you just get? Actually, I'm not complaining. What is it? Tell me I just got the exact same one I traded. Hold on. I got a temple. It's a level 15, which mine was level 15. Who's the original owner? Okay, Liam. I was... Liam just thought you were going to miss it. You did say you love temple. He's helping you out. 
<sighs> it's got up a special. It's got up and special attack nature. Is it down in attack though? No, it's down in special defense. It's not the worst because it's not down in attack. Yeah, I know. Do I put it on the team now? I think I just rock with Choodle a little bit longer, honestly. I don't feel like grinding right now. So, yeah, my surprise trades were pretty much bum. Not really good at all, honestly. Well, I've only gotten the Gibble so far, um, but I've also got the Toxel to surprise trade still, and I'm also catching uh, my next encounter. I am battling the interview people that came the whole way from Hoenn to interview me. Oh, dang. Yeah, dude. Yeah. It's because they know. They dude, know that, like that the... you got a new fire series on the YouTube going on. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Exactly. I mean, at this point, like, what episode are we on now? Six? This is seven? Number, this is number six. This is number six. This is number six. I mean, yeah, at this point, like, if you've made it this far, you're clearly enjoying the series. So, like, why don't, why don't you give us a nice sub? Show some love. Let us know who you think's going to win in the comment section down below. Yeah, I mean, that's the real question here. Who's going to win at the end of the day? And if your answer's Team Roki, then I'm sorry you're wrong. That's all right. You can just you, you can spam Team Roki on my channel, I guess. We don't want to upset Salty. Oh, you won't upset me. I'm just letting you know you're wrong. I'm just letting you know you're wrong. I just don't want you to get salty. That's all. Oh, wow. Wow, he says the pun. I did it. <laughs> uh, I gotta update the dock with my gibble. I'd always let do like, oh, dude, that is a lot of levels. That is, is not a level. <laughs> that is not under level 24, Hatterene. Hatterene. I don't Ooh, think Hatterene's level, level 24. No. Yeah, no, there's no way Hatterene's level 24 and under. I think it evolves if it is, at level 30 illegal. or 35. Oh no! You thundershocked my drill burr! Mm -hmm. Dummy. Do, do, do. Yo, I like Helio. 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 It is cool, little son. Actually, I, can't, I was about to say I can't say this, but I can say it. Um, in a failed recording, um, well, me and um, me and Pancake had some issues with our Oras lockout, which went live this past week. I don't know which day, but it definitely did go live this past week. Um, we actually had a failed recording session of four episodes uh, due to technical difficulties on my side, recording wise, uh, because like I had changed my recording sessions for the way we recorded last week. Um, and I I forgot to change the advent the advanced uh I forgot to change the tracks back. Oh no! So it messed up my audio. So um, yeah, we ended up losing a recording session. So we had to do. But he actually ended up getting Healy Optile as a starter, and he hated it. Jeez, really? But it was his best option. But he hated it. Oh my gosh! See, I think it's a like. I don't get the fact that it's like a normal. You eat that like freaking brecky. I don't get the fact that it's like normal electric. Like to me, just adding normal type to a Pokemon just because just seems kind of lousy. Yeah. Um. I mean, like, yeah, you get that stab boost for like early on, but like, like, what are you gonna do? Give it return? Like, maybe facade if you want to build it like guts or not guts, but like. Put like flame orb or something on it, but like it just doesn't make sense. No, nah, it doesn't. But no. like, yeah. So, but he was just like so rattled about it. He hated them on. Yeah, I. It always sucks when like you do randomize and then you try and like, you're hoping for really hype starters and then it's like just doesn't work out. Yeah. Or you for get sure. like a hype starter, then you have a problem with it and have to re-record and then you get really bad starters. Definitely, like, definitely. That happened to me in the first one. Like I was doing like red ninety or my red eight ninety eight, and I messed up something along the way. Um, but when I got to my starters, like my first starter was a Reggie Rock. Which, granted, it in that game might only have explosion, explosion. 
But like still, it's a Reggie Rock. Like that would have been absolutely insane to have at the beginning. Please tell me this is legit. If this is legit, I'm gonna cry. I might cry too if it's legit. Oh, you're gonna cry. Oh boy, what does Salty have this time? The only issue is, is I'm getting repeat typings, but it's so good. Dude, my BDSP series, I had a rule that like completely screwed me a lot of times, but I couldn't have any duplicate typings of any sort. Oh, that's not a bad rule. I like that for like regular Let's Plays. Oh yeah, dude. Especially, well, on top of a hardcore Nuzlocke, like it's, it got oh pretty insane, God. but like, yeah, dude. And it sucks because like, uh, like I had Machop and Chimchar, and then when Chimchar evolved, I couldn't use my Machoke. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, ooh, hold on. I need but, to check the level of this because this might be. It's legal. It's totally legit. I'm. You're going right on the team. By the way, I just got to mimic you. Okay, that's pretty pog. That is really pog. Yeah. I got a Drifloom. Ooh. Oh, we both got ghost types. Yeah, I can live with Drifloom, honestly. Um, let me I see. can live with you having a Drifloom. Yeah, it's not too bad. Um. Who do I, now the question is, who do I want to take off the team for it? Uh, I'm just really, I'm really hoping this Mimikyu gets some better moves. I'm gonna do this for like different, different blah, 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 blah. I can't speak for duplicate typings. I'm really hoping like I, I've got some better level one moves. Yeah, that's always like I love that they have that you can just go and get your moves. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, I got, yeah, it's literally the best I got the Toxel. I love that Toxel's wearing like a diaper. Like with its like design. Yeah, that's hilarious. It is so cute. Alright, send a box. We're gonna surprise trade this bad boy. I would love a Toxel on my team, honestly. Like I'm just thinking through like my first time playing through Sword and like my team, like uh like that whole first experience through any Pokemon game. I, I don't know about you, but it is just so magical honestly it is actually like like i do a lock type uh generally for my first playthrough which i'm gonna bring back when sword and shield does i never finished it sorry for scarlet and violet i never finished it for sword and shield but i wish i did the reason i didn't finish it though is because i went on vacation and then when i came back i ended up not continuing it um but i do a gen lock where like a gen lock is you have to use pokemon of a certain gen exclusively on your team yeah. And I just always make it to the new gen. So I'm going to, like, for Sword and Shield, I was doing a gen 8 gen lock. So I was only allowed to use the new Sword and Shield Pokemon. So for Scarlet and Violet, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to do... Sorry, that's my dog losing her <laughs> shit. Mally! Ooh. Ooh, uh, your puppy! Yeah, she sees a dog or a squirrel outside and wants to go after it. Um, yeah, that's my dog. Yeah, but I'm going to do a Gen 9 Gen Lock for Scarlet and Violet, uh, most likely. I might do it as a live stream series. I'm going to see. Because I already have my first Scarlet and Violet series scheduled, and I'm going to be, like, binge recording it the first weekend. Yeah, I like the concept behind that, honestly, because that's always, like, my thought. Like, anytime I play through a new game, like, I want to use the new Pokemon to yeah. get, like, that full experience with them. Exactly. Yes. Yes. Like, I don't yes, want to be going through the game you, and then Arceus. being forced to use it. What the hell did you just get? It's nothing that's, like, insane, but I, I absolutely love this Pokemon and the versatility of it. I got myself... Ooh, I have an idea for you. I got myself an Umbreon. Or not an Umbreon, an Eevee. Oh, so you're going to put it as an Umbreon. Um, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to evolve it into yet. Because the problem is, is, like, you can't get Umbreon until, like, way later in the game. Well, no. Umbreon is, um, uh, friendship. Well, yeah. But, like, you have to evolve it at night. And there's only certain points in the game that's night. We're actually coming up to one of the only points where it's night in the game. Until you get to, like, late game. No. Night is just dependent on, uh, if you play at night, it's nighttime. Is it? Because, like, I had a problem where I couldn't evolve, um, what's it called? Why can't I think what it's called? Where I couldn't evolve the um, Snom. Really? For some reason. Yeah. 
Like, I could not evolve it. And then, finally, like, after I beat the game or whatever, I was able to. Like, so... Because cause the game itself, like, it has a... Like, an in-game night and day system, but it doesn't register the in-day... Like, the in-game huh. night and day system until you beat it. Oh, I didn't realize that. Yeah, so, like, there's only specific points in the game where it's, like, actually goes to night. Because, like... Like, we did our last session, like, you'll see in the recordings, like, everything's day, but I'm recording at night. Like, we're both recording at night, I guess. Yes. Well, right now we're so, both recording during the day. Well, yeah, 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 but I think it was later whenever we did that one. But, like, the in-game is still day. Yeah. Which I always thought was kind of weird. Like, if you're going to make, like, day and night, just make full day and night. Like, it's almost like the way that the game plays out with, like, the story and day and night system... You basically make it to the championship in, like, two days. Yeah. It's kind of crazy. Oh, I wish this was useful. Mally! Mally! Stop losing your shit! Oh, my bad. What happened? I swore. Oh, dude, it's okay. There's been a couple. Plus, we're on your uh, your your. Oh yeah, we're on an episode. Plus, we're on your channel, so I mean, like, if you want to censor it, you're welcome to. But I'm not gonna ever ask somebody to like censor their own channel. I just do Mally. it for mine and stuff. Just you know, certain people that watch it, I try and yeah. make sure I keep it PG for them. For sure, for sure. But that's the thing, though. Like, obviously, like going out and branching out is I'm like working with other like content creators and stuff. Like, it's. You know, it does become something that you're never going to be able to fully avoid, obviously. And, like, I'm not by any means, like, one of those, like, Oh, you can't swear, that's bad. You yeah. know. But, plus I had fun with it, dude. I did, like, in episode three, I had fun with, like, all the different edits and stuff. Because it was a couple different moments that I had to censor. But, like, I had a blast with them. Like, I think really? they're funny. I thought, I... I thought I was doing a good job. No, you're good. There was There was only, like... I think two for you and then one for me myself, which is the the Machoke joke. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I thought that edit actually turned out pretty funny, though. Ooh, Thievul, don't hurt me. Thievul, don't hurt me. Thievul, don't hurt me. Which grunt are you on? Uh, the second. Uh, the first one. First one? Wow, dude, you really need to speed it up. Well, I battled everything, and then I went back to the Pokemon Center to reteach a Pokemon a certain move. Oh, um, dude, I'm already, like, about to take on the gym. Are you actually? Are you already in the next town? Yeah, why not? I mean, okay. No, nah, I'm taking on the second grunt right now. <laughs> yeah, I think I just beat the first imagine? one. The guy's the episode, first one, right? Episode one, I'm in, like, an entire episode behind, basically, in the first ten minutes. And then all of a sudden, I'm just, like spamming through the game <laughs> well i battled did you battle all the trainers on the route before no i skipped oh, them I, all i i battled them all. oh yeah oh well i was dealing with like my surprise trays and stuff for a little longer i guess oh well, i still like, I was in the wild area i'm just battling while i do get them like i i still have two i still have the toxel um and my last surprise trade i ended up getting a level 60 snorlax so can't really use that mm -hmm. Yeah, unfortunately not. But Snorlax is just a great one to have. It's just a wall, man. It's kind of hoping for the level one Snorlax, but... It makes me sad that you have to work to get a Munchlax just to evolve it. Like, yeah. like why can't it just be an egg and be a Munchlax, which completely makes sense because Munchlax evolves into Snorlax. All the baby Pokemon, you have to do... You have to, like... um breed with a held item to get that pokemon as a baby and see that's just weird to me like that just doesn't make sense like you're telling me that i can have oh frick uh am i What's healed a... oh, okay, oh for I the second one here. no for the hot battle oh yes um all right who do i want to leave the thing here? is i had to box my nido king because it was level 23 <laughs> So, like, I have to go into this hot battle without my Nido King. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, frick, you're right. I just realized that, too. Yeah, I need to get my Lapyro off my team. Uh, what's which Roly Coley, I guess? Um, all right, yeah, so I say which we take big. on... Which is big, because you're, you're going up against a Thwacky here. 
Yeah, I knew. Uh, who do I want to start off with? You know what? I'm going to start off with my Choodle. Choodle's a little dorbs. Ooh, I just got a level 6 Rookity. Ooh, it is Rookity's a good one. Def yeah, they met them at level 1 and just... Somebody in Italy just chance just sent me a level 1 Rookity. Yo, why does the hop theme, like, slap so hard? Oh, it does. It does. Um, like, it's just such good vibes. Thing is, I'm definitely not going to want to lead my pumpkin pie versus his thing. Versus first Pokemon, so I'm going to do that. Uh, bag. Oh, man. Double kick would have been really nice against this thick boy, Wooloo. Oh, yeah. He leads the Wooloo first, right? Yeah, you're welcome. For some reason, I, I mean, no. He leads with, uh... Uh... Snorlax. He doesn't have Snorlax yet. He does later, though. Does he get? I think he gets rid of his Wooloo for it. Yeah, and then he ends up bringing it back later on, like when it's double. Yeah. Like, he swaps his team out a little bit, but it's really weird, like, some of the changes he, like, makes and then makes them back, and, like, I don't know. Like, I feel like they should have made his team a lot more, like, Galar Pokemon and stuff. Yeah. Because I kind of feel like they just threw him, like, ri really going to Super Potion? You're going to lose. Yeah, and then he has, like, Cramorant for one battle. Yeah, like, that's what I'm saying. All right, Hi, you know Wooloo. what, Wooloo? I'm done with you. Wooloo, Dragon I Tail. traded you. This, I traded this thing is defense Wooloo. curled a hundred times. I'm just Dragon Tailing it out of here at this point. Wooloo, I, I traded you, and I do not feel bad about it. I'm at, like, I'm just waiting for us to get one of our Pokemon back. Okay, Thwacky was not who I wanted you to go out to here. Uh, oh, yeah, we're in set. <laughs> well, I use oh. Dragon Tail. I know, but we're in set battle style, too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. What are rules whenever you're in the middle of a game? Yep. Have a taste uh, of our true green power. He, like, lights up a bowl. I'm going to have to swap out my... <laughs> My Gorgeist is going to have to take a seat after this battle, too, until the gym. Why does that do so much damage? Corvus Squire, how about we don't, okay? This might be a bad idea. I might be misplaying here. Okay. Oh, it's a crit! It is a crit! Oh. Should be able to go for this, no problem. Oh, oh my gosh. What's wrong? Oh my gosh, dude. My cheeks literally went from unclenched to full cl full clench mode right now, dude. What happened? Yo, my, my PP got critted, and now I have two HP left. Your PP is still alive? I thought you I thought your butterfree died. No, 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 no. PP is Clefairy. Oh yes. Yeah, but I got a crit and it hit me down to two. Alright, can you hit yourself? Hit yourself. No, come on. Not gonna lie, not having my reboot here literally makes this such a difficult... Like, this happened to me with a Bede fight. Like, I just did not have what I needed to do good on that, like, that well, fight. Well, the thing is, like, you could have brought him and risked it because, like, you can go up to... You can go into the gym with 24s, and we made a rule that if they go above level 24 inside the gym, then it's okay. Um, it's just you can't go into the gym with anything higher than level 24. Yeah. But the thing is, if they get above level 24, like, if they get to level 25 in the wild, <laughs> like, before the gym, they're locked out of the gym. Dude, I have the worst luck. So. Oh, I can't heal in battle. I can't heal Three times. Three times it doesn't hit itself in confusion. So I'm like, you know what? Screw it. I'm going to use payback. It's going to hit me, and I'm going to do double damage. That's the one time that it actually hits itself in confusion. Whoa. <laughs> Right. I'm like, dude, come on. The game All just right, said, so... get screwed. I'm telling you, man, like... I almost went to heal no, there, no. and I'm like, wait, hardcore, can't heal, can't heal. Yeah, I'm, like, so terrified that I'm going to break the rules, and somebody's going to call me out and be like, Roki's a cheater, Roki cheated. He should, he should be disqualified from the series completely because he cheated and used one potion on a Pokemon that died anyway. Yeah, exactly. But by the way, guys, let us know in the comments if we ever do cheat. We'll figure out a way to punish each other. 
Absolutely, absolutely. We'll always find fun ways to do it here. I don't know about you, Salty, but I always like a fun little challenge. I know you do. I've yep. seen your TikToks. Oh, yeah. You like I those had, fun little challenges. I used to have dares in my TikToks, and... Um, Fun fact, um, it might the series might come to TikTok sooner than YouTube. Uh, but May twentieth, twenty May twenty first is the latest that my new series will be dropping both on shorts and TikTok, and dares will return. However, dares will only come from my friends and family. IRL hey. and online friends. So Roki, I might text you for a dare if I ever have a Pokemon that dies. Dude, I just want to tell you right now, you might regret it if you ever text me for a dare. Dude, I my roommate made me use a smear goal for the entire gym. I um, saw that one. That was rough. Yeah, you did it good though. You you set that thing up good. I did uh, sketch. I literally had to sketch my own Pokemon, uh, rival Pokemon. Oh, it was so good. Um, but I've done that. Um, Westy. Um, West gave me a dare that like I could only use the top left move. Uh, sorry, the top right move throughout the entire battle on all of my Pokemon. That's actually a really cool one, too. Yeah, yeah there's they've a come lot up, of really cool ones that I saw. I've had a lot of stuff that's like a uh, cool one. Uh, Westy's first ever dare for me. Um, what The first time I asked him for a dare and he gave me it, it was literally, I texted him, I'm like, hey, I just lost a Mon, I need a dare. Well, no, he texted me before. You, you, Me and you have even talked about this. He texted me before he even needed the dare. I like texted him, hey, and then he's like, hey, do you need a dare? And then it was like, yeah, release your <laughs> highest level Pokemon. I saw that. I was like, dude, woke up and chose violence this morning. Like he was, he was like, hey, if he ever texts me, I'm just going to immediately assume it's for a dare and I'm going to make him sack his like strongest mom. Well, me and him were doing a soul Savage. link at the time. So I did tell him that like, if I ever lost another Pokemon, I was going to call him up for a dare. So like, he kind of had an idea. But, like, man, like, he had an idea. And then, like, oh, he yeah. had an idea for a dare ready. Oh, yeah, dude. He, he like I said, he was he was ready for it. Man, I'm not getting but, anything from these surprise trades right now. I don't know about you, but I just beat Hop. Uh, yeah, same. Okay, cool. Oh, and my Toodle's evolving! Ah! <laughs> Oh, dude. I love how early Chudo evolves. Dreadnought is going to help me a ton. Especially going into this next cage match, if I decide to use it, that is. Mm, let's go right ahead. Yeah. Against your, your Gorgeist that, you know, could completely disintegrate it. All the glass. Ooh, trade completed. I reset my surprise trade, and immediately the trade was completed. Yeah, it's weird how it does that sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes it just needs that reset. Ooh. Yeah, exactly. Oh, dude. Why is Salty getting all the good encounters and I'm getting literal freaking dog water? I don't have this typing either. Now, your Dreadnought would eat this thing for lunch, breakfast, and dinner. Oh, well, but my like... Dreadnought's a hungry boy. Oh, my God. It's level one. I just got a German. This guy. Who the frick does he think he is? Oh, it's, it's Blaze, though. Uh, but up in speed, flamethrower and flare blitz already? Yeah, come on, bro. Come on. This guy. Charmander. Um, yeah. Oh, rookity two, rookity. I think we should wrap up here. We're at 35 minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, yeah. And then in the next gonna... episode, we're definitely going to take, we're definitely going to get our next encounter. We got some story stuff to do, and maybe we'll start the gym. Yeah, I mean, I definitely think that we can do the gym next episode. We'll definitely be at that point, and that means that there will be a cage match. Yep. On not on my episode, but on Salty's episode. What day it is that, Salty? On... You're gonna have to remind me. It 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 would be on your episode is the Tuesday. My episode would be the Thursday. Okay. Well, there might be a cage match this Thursday, then, guys. So make sure you stay tuned for that. Yep, but guys, that is going to be it for this one, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy, and as always, stay salty.